Many proteins are composed of multiple polypeptide chains, or subunits. The Crow repressor, for example, is a homodimer formed of two identical subunits. The subunits join in a head-to-head -head fashion as two small beta sheets, one from each subunit, zipper up and form a larger beta sheet. The enzyme neuraminidase is composed of four identical subunits arranged in a square. Each pair of two subunits is held together in head-to-tail fashion by repeated use of the same binding interaction. This becomes clear when the polypeptide chains are colored in a rainbow pattern so that the same regions of each subunit have the same colors. All subunits adhere to each other through contacts between the orange and light blue regions. Hemoglobin is a tetrameric protein that transports oxygen. It is composed of two alpha subunits and two closely related beta subunits. Oxygen binds to heme groups in the protein, which are shown in red. Each subunit can sense whether neighboring subunits contain bound oxygen. The protein subunits therefore communicate with one another through the interfaces that hold them together. The tumor suppressor protein, P53, is a tetramer of four identical subunits. Each P53 subunit contains a simple tetramerization domain composed of a single beta strand connected to an alpha helix. The tetrameric form of P53 assembles as a dimer of dimers. Two copies of P53 interact via beta strands, forming a two-stranded beta sheet. Two such dimers interact via their alpha helices to form the tetrameric assembly.